No, beetle not chewing. Welcome to Papua New Guinea. Setting off and arriving in Papua New Guinea was kind of crazy because I didn't know anybody on the trek. I'd missed the Skype meetings and I have to spend nine solid days with these people. So Jesus, we're living in each other's pockets. Something's gonna go wrong or something's gonna be crazy or I'm gonna, I'm gonna hate someone or somebody's gonna hate me. So I was a little bit, I was a little bit anxious, um, but also really excited because um, because it was it was like this big black hole in front of me. So we've met everybody today from Canteen who are trekking. Everybody seems really nice, everybody's really excited, I'm really excited. You arrive at Kokoda, then you start taking off and it's flat and then you get to your first hill and you're like, oh my god. <sighs> Day one, Kokoda, woo! Um, it's raining, mm, my tent has holes in it. <sighs> it was actually pretty good today, we did 6Ks um, over three hours, some severe hills, there were some tears, there was a few people that were almost left behind, but um, so far so good. I've got nine days of this and you start chatting with everybody and it's like, oh okay, so you're all right. You're kind of crazy and we might get along. Woo, day two Kokoda Trek. So we started today off at 5 a.m. Bright and early, nice and brutal. Breakfast was pretty pov. Our porters today have been amazing. I got my porter, my porter's name is Mobe and he was so cute. He was the shortest out of the group and I'm probably the tallest female in the group so it was quite funny when we got together because everybody laughed. Today there was all these insane river crossing because of landslides and they just build bridges for us to like walk over. It was quite amazing. Um, I fell over today, that was fun. We learned some amazing stuff about the war and what the Anzacs did here. Uh, lunch was like spam. Mmm, spam. So much spam. They fried spam and they tried to hide it. Like we were eating dog food and you know how you hide tablets and dog's food? They'd like hide spam in the pasta. <laughs> I'd be like, I know there's spam in there. I can taste it. Yeah. Kokoda. Here's another lovely campsite. We're starting to feel it today. My socks are wet and my knees are sore, my ankles are sore. Say hi, Moby. <laughs> we have sore legs. It's all downhill from here, which isn't necessarily a good thing. And my collarbones are hurting, but that's a skinny bitch problem. Today was so hard. I don't know how some of the girls made it either. Zoe's, Zoe, who's the doctor, her feet are so badly damaged. She has completely removed the entire back patch of her heel. We're talking like eight layers of skin. Oh, in all the years of modeling, I've never seen at any fashion week all over the world, blisters as revolting as this. And we're in the cloud and I'm feeling a bit sick. My tent's all packed up and breakfast is delicious as usual. Pipelets and some other form of carbohydrate. And um, hopefully nobody's standing behind me today on the track because I'm going to be farting. Oh. Bye! Day six begins. We're all feeling a little sore. Really enjoying the bathroom situation considering my stomach is in quite a state. Um, and yeah, now I need to concentrate on a hill. <laughs> so bloody hot. We did some serious downs and ups today. I got my first le leech bite today. It was a fat one. You suck some of my blood. It was great. Um, we had lunch at a river, which was amazing. We got to swim in the river. Heaven, day seven. Yeah, made it to the river. It's lunchtime and it's only 10 past 11, but we're starving. Say hello. 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 My feet are sore and my gut is grumbling. And I've got some blisters! But I'm happy! Woo day 
48. We're a little bit sleepy. Another 5 a.m. wake up call. Our porters this morning um, sang a really nice song to start the day. We had another delicious breakfast. And um, it's time to brush my teeth and wake up. Wow, I'm still in paradise. Yes, please. Last night sleeping in a tent and I've had a pretty awesome time with a bunch of lunatics which have been great and canteen. What an amazing place to walk for. Um, tonight got pretty hectic. We had to move half the tents because the river was rising so high. It was like, God, the flood waters had opened. Another crack a day of undulating hills. Oh, first hill almost killed me though. Um, I've got the sand in my shoes and um, I can't wait for a solid shower. God, I really need to shave my legs. But besides that, oh, I wouldn't mind a salad as well. Yeah, that'd be pretty good. Yeah, it's kind of wet. Thank God I think this is making up for all the days that we missed out on the rain. Smile, Chucky. <laughs> Last hill. That was epic. Hi, baby. Yay! Yeah. That lunatic move. Last bit. We made it. We made it. The end of Kokoda. Oh, wow. What an adventure. Oh my god, we made it to the hotel! Unbelievable! Quick turn on the air conditioner, smash some minibar! Cold Coke. Oh my god. We all stink so bad. We stink so bad that they wouldn't even let us into the lobby. We had to take the staff entrance and the staff elevator. Uh, wow, what an adventure. How cool is that?